So um, I'm called Honest, and as far as where I'm from, originally I'm from my mother. And uh, as far as what I'm doing with the bus, um, I guess the best way I could tell it to you is that I spent all morning dodging dog shit. In a world where on sale really just means for sale, but we're trying harder to get your business. Did you get what you paid for? What's your money worth? Value is subjective, like beauty being in the eyes of the beholder, so hold her a little bit bolder, because the world's grown colder the more I get older. Just another trip around the sun. Let's make them more fun than the last, but remember your past, because it's the mast, allowing for wind in your sails, pushing past whales way faster than the snails that surround me in this environment that bound me, but only for a moment, so I could learn from the torment of a generation raised on GMOs, bitches and hoes, and babies sat by TV. That shit ain't for me. I got a thirst for reality, not some show. I'm talking about shit you don't know, like growing my own groceries, generating energies, and learning my enemies are few and far between. But right now, they run the scene. You say, sir, whatever do you mean? There's Nazis in the eagle's nest. There is no rest for the wicked until you fill the bucket and kick it with ice-cold homies, driving Zambonis to smooth out the surface, roughed up by urges and selfish pretense for which there is no defense except to turn the other cheek. Earth shall be inherited by the meek. According to prophecy that intrigues me, feeds me, and needs me to share it with you, get a clue about what to do in case of emergency or urgency to care for those in need of the tools to succeed and secede from a union of slaves serving masters and firing blasters at each other. But for what? Another cigarette butt? We'll smoke them up, Johnny, in quest for the rest of the rat race, trying to make face in a palace full of posers, fighting for closures in a fantasy called freedom that's really just a part of the kingdom. Naming names is all fun and games, unless you choke up on fear, unable to take a look in the mirror, my, my, what am I but shameless. And I will dirty that name since it's already shit on and shed it like a snake does skin. For my kin, I can stand up to the man and fuck up his master plan of global domination, free thinker incarceration, and mind control called education. This is a war that we're in, and I know not where to begin except say stay away from sin and find the power within to move more than just mountains. I'm talking youth fountains, yeah, with this new sound is a whole lot of potential to drive your grandma mental with the pedal to the metal of a 69 summer speedster who became a teacher with a loudspeaker and now you can hear her advice. Find a girl made of sugar and spice and everything nice. Or oh, naughty, this is the key to life, the party, and I'ma tell you twice, all righty, the British are coming, the British are coming, and now are they running this country in and out of office in a way that I find lawless, so I plan to be flawless in my rebuttal, calling the herd to a huddle, so we could assemble the masses for some classes on his story and what those lies mean for you and me, born blinded in misery, finally opening all three eyes to see the negativity that they have numbed you with for the sake of wage slavery that I'm done with. Representing myself, put down by those with wealth beyond reason, for hunting out a season, state police making fish out of men. And I'm standing in that moon mirror, not knowing what else to do, because there are no men or women here, just males and females with no clue. They will not stand upon their own two legs and fight, because they're chickens herded to the fox's den. For dinner tonight, for dinner tonight, it's poor man's delight. Just remember that the house can catch fire from the candlelight. And as far as love goes, love can mean a lot of different things to a lot of different people at a lot of different times in a lot of different ways. In fact, other languages have multiple words for different types of love. So I'd say that rather than trying to define love, it'd be better to say what love isn't. And I would say that judgment is the absence of love. And when you're passing judgment on somebody, then you're not giving them a chance. And um, you're not treating them as you would yourself. And that is the same thing as destruction. That is the dark side of the yin-yang. Um, but treating somebody as yourself or as you would be wanted to be treated, that's the golden rule. And that's the only way that uh, the human race is going to continue on. Like, is if we all recognize that um, we all have an equal right to be here and we all have something to contribute. Um, I feel that there are powers that be entities that are intentionally hindering um, the evolution of consciousness because it would mean that they no longer are sitting on the top of the pyramid.
And I'd say that um, their lack of compassion for all the people who are holding them up and giving them what they have, that is what's going to tear everything apart. And that's what's destroying the planet right now. And that's what's going to make it to where we can't live here the same way we, we thought we could. Um, I'd say that we all need to go back to kindergarten for adults and learn how to share again. Um, as far as what I'm doing with my life, um, I'm understanding that I am at war. And in the book, The Art of War by Sun Tzu, um, the victor is determined by who has the best strategy. And who has the best strategy is based on who has information, who has more information on their enemy. If, if you have more information on your enemy, then you're going to have a better strategy than they have on you. And um, so that means passing judgment when people are asking you for information. And so when I consent to give this information to this camera, I am not passing judgment and I am doing it without fear that there will be a negative repercussion. Whether the people who are making this have that um, intention or not is like irrelevant because this could still be put on the internet, the internet could still be censored, and then the powers that be that shut the internet down could still have all this information that I'm providing. So I'm choosing to ignore the fear that this could be harmful to me in order to spread my heart song. And um, I hope that you got something out of it. Music is the m mu is mother and sick is science. So music is the mother science. Music is vibration. And if you look at things down to you know atoms and even smaller, everything really comes down to different vibrations and frequencies. And so music is vibration, sound is vibration. Um, you know, we're, we're all made out of vibrating particles. So um, music is communication um, through vibration and um, maybe it can change your vibration. Thanks, brother. Yeah, I hope it was worth the wait. Yeah, definitely. Thank you, man. Mm -hmm. Beautiful stuff.